If you create video content for online marketing to attract leads, nurture leads, and make sales, you'd probably love it if you could use AI to edit all your videos for you. But can AI actually do that? Well, not quite yet, but it's getting a whole lot closer, especially with some of the new releases from Meta. And by the end of this video, you're gonna know exactly what Meta's released in terms of new AI video editing tools, where they're at, what the limitations are, and where they're going in the future. Let's dive in. If you've ever edited any video content, you know how time consuming it can be. Well, thanks to AI, editing your own videos could be a thing of the past. In the very near future, AI could do it all for you. And Meta is releasing a lot of new AI tools that are making this much more possible very quickly. Let me show you where Meta AI has come from already in a very short period of time. So first it was used for images like this. You could put in a text-based prompt. So this says a tiny woman sitting on a delicate flower pattern etc etc and then it creates an image for you this was the first variation of meta ai's image or video creation set of tools then it released a more advanced version that allowed us to do things like this in this case it's still a text prompt that created this image but now meta ai could actually animate the image for you so it's taking static images and then animating those images then the next step the next evolution of meta ai allowed you to actually create video content directly from text prompts Here's the classic example. This was used in all of Meta's promotion for this new version of Meta AI. And it was simply a text prompt that created this little mini hippo swimming in the water. So these are examples of where Meta AI has come from, but now it's taking things to the next level, not only allowing us to create images or animated images or even videos from text, but also allowing us to upload content and then edit that content from text prompts. Let me show you how this works. I'm gonna go over to Meta AI here, and you can do this on your desktop simply by going to meta.ai, or you can do this on mobile if you download the Meta AI app. And the first thing you wanna do is click on the little plus button here, click this, and we're gonna upload a file or image, click on that, and here's the video that I'm gonna upload. And we'll take a minute to upload this video, so just wait while it uploads your content for you. And here it is, here's my video. Now, the first thing that you'll notice here is that there's this trim video option right here. Let's click on this and you'll see that you've got this little slider down at the bottom that allows you to select which section of your video you wanna edit using Meta AI. Now, this is one of the limitations right now. You'll notice that this little slider, it allows me to grab 10 seconds of my video only, and that is the maximum capacity for Meta AI at this point. So I could use these little side edges of the slider to shorten the section of the video that I wanna edit, or in this case, I'm gonna maximize it. I'm gonna have it at 10 seconds, and I'm just gonna take the first 10 seconds of this clip and go ahead and click on the little check mark here. And so once you've done that, once you've trimmed the clip that you wanna use Meta AI to edit, now it's time to actually choose how you want it to edit that clip. And the first thing you'll notice over here on the left-hand panel is that there isn't a text box. There isn't yet a place where you can put in a prompt like say, increase the lighting or change the speed I'm talking at. That is coming down the pipeline, but right now there are simply presets. And what Meta AI has basically done is it's taken those text prompts, it's done them for you, and then allows you to choose from a preset to change the visual appeal of your little video clip that you put in here. So you can see that these ones here, it says there's some popular edits, there's different outfits and accessories that you can add to yourself. Let's scroll down here. You can see this one changes the background, so different locations and etc. You can do all kinds of funny things or weird things to your video. And so let's go ahead and try one of these. I'm just gonna pick this first one, Tuxedo, and you can see Meta AI is going to work. It'll show a little percentage indicator showing how much of the video has been processed. And while that's processing, it's really important to understand What's the purpose of this right now? Because you'll see that this is really just a fun, neat little visual trick that you can apply to your videos, but this is a starting point. Like I said, Meta AI is moving us towards the point where simply you put in a text prompt and that text prompt will be automatically applied to your video. It'll edit your video according to whatever you put into that text prompt. And you'll see here's the finished product. So it took that video that I'd uploaded and instead of me wearing my regular clothes, it's added me to a tuxedo and put sort of this fancy background in behind me speaking. And it looks pretty good. From here, here are your options. You can hover over your edited video and you can click on the download button and that'll go ahead and download the edited version. You can also go over here in the top right hand corner, click on share. And this will give you an opportunity to post this directly to your feed, either in Facebook or in Instagram. But going back to the purpose of Meta AI's video editing tools, is this actually a tool that's gonna edit all your videos for you? 
No, not yet. Right now, it's just fun. It's just something that's visually appealing. It could allow you to edit your videos and maybe grab some more attention when you post these into your newsfeed. But more importantly, it gives you a glimpse as to where AI is headed. You can imagine a very near future where you'll be able to upload your videos, put in your text prompts, tell AI exactly how you want those videos edited, and it'll go ahead and it'll trim the videos for you. It'll apply any effects, it'll apply lighting, it'll apply colors, and it'll transcribe your videos and add subtitles for you all your editing will very shortly be done by AI, which is pretty exciting. That will make it a lot easier for you to create videos that you can use for online marketing. And that's my plan, but I also have a secret weapon and the secret weapon is Unipro. Unipro is an amazing tool that goes out onto Facebook. It finds your ideal leads. It brings those leads over into your audience and it makes sure that those leads see your content, whether it be video content, written content, image content, and it nurtures those leads and then goes over into Messenger and Unipro makes them an offer at the time they're most likely to buy from you. Unipro has been a game changer for my business and I know it will be for you as well. So if you haven't checked it out yet, go over to unipro.com. That's what I've got for you in this video all about Meta AI's video editing tools, where they're at right now and where they're going in the future. If this was helpful, give it a like. And if you have any questions about how to use Meta AI, go ahead and leave those in the comments below. I'm happy to help out. And again, if you're running an online business and you're looking to grow your audience and get more attention from your posts, you got to check out Unipro. Go over to unipro.com. It's really going to help you build your business a whole lot faster. Thanks for checking out this video. Can't wait to see it in the next video.